I'm heading to a place you have never heard of. I actually have goosebumps in oh, That is not the start to Salzburg we wanted. I think I get to the train station with plenty of time. I'm looking for my platform, can't find it anywhere. I'm like, I know I'm early, but it doesn't seem right. So I go to the ticket office and apparently I am at the wrong train station here in Vienna. I then tried to get to the station I'm supposed to be at and realized I had nowhere near enough time to get there. Luckily at the ticket office they were helpful and I have been able to buy a new ticket to leave from this station. The only annoyance is that it's cost me an extra 50 euros. The joys of travel. I'm so keen for Salzburg. Let's go. I've just dropped my bags off at the hotel. I can't check in until 3 p.m. and it's about 12 p.m. now. So I've got three hours, so I'm gonna walk to Old Town, grab some lunch, and then go from there. Oh my God, what is this? What the hell is this? Well, that just happened. So you just walk through the middle of a mountain to get to the other side of town. Where am I? Statues of horses in bubble. What? Mainly wanting to come here for the scenery and for the nature side of things. Haven't done a lot of research on the town itself and activities to do that aren't necessarily nature based. That I do not know about. Not surprising, but I feel like every second store I'm sort of referenced to Mozart. I get it, I really do. Come on, bit of an overkill show. The yellow building you just saw behind me is actually the birthplace of Mozart. I want to go check out this bridge because apparently it has a fantastic spot to take some photos of the river and some of the buildings along the river as well. The present has no river. This has to be one of the most picturesque rivers in all of Europe, if not the world. Oh my god. I could just imagine what this place would be like in the middle of winter when it's just all covered in snow, the river's iced over. Wow. I'm gonna go quickly eat some lunch because I'm starving and then continue to explore Old Town. Let's go. What's up everyone? I've just completed my tour at the castle here in Salzburg and oh my God. I have honestly had the best couple hours after arriving here. That was such an amazing experience. The scenery from the top of the castle was something out of a picture book. Things that you see as a kid or on postcards or whatever, it was honestly magnificent. That's enough of me talking about it. Let me just show you. Let's go. insane is that place and trust me when I say this the GoPro does not do any of that justice whatsoever I'll see everyone at the Red Bull hangar let's go I have a very strong feeling that uh, not many Aussies have been in this part of Austria we've got a blue building over there a yellow house a brown house a green house but they love their colors way different to the Aussies who build a house and then we build 150 lookalikes of the exact same house no uniqueness whatsoever. It is so different. I actually have goosebumps. This place is gorgeous. I'm about to enter here at the Red Bull Lounge. A nice added bonus to this place is that it is free entry. So anytime you can do something for free, you, are, you take the opportunity, that's for sure.
how epic was the Red Bull hangar? That was to be able to walk through the those F1 cars and some of the planes as well. That was fantastic. Loved every second of it. It's about 10 o'clock at night now. I've just finished up at dinner. Had a massive calzone, which I'll uh, I'll put here now. Calzone was fantastic. Best dessert in the world, hands down, is ice cream slash gelato. Absolutely the best. I am now back at the hotel for the night. Finish off my ice cream, have a shower, get to bed at a reasonable time, hopefully by about midnight, and then up early for tomorrow. What an exciting day ahead. Let's go. Morning, everyone. Had an absolutely terrible night of sleep last night, but that's all good. Got a cappuccino in hand. I'm now heading back into the city. I think it's about 8 p.m. roughly now. I've just woken up. I was feeling absolutely terrible, so I went back to the hotel and just crashed, and I've just gotten up, so I'm gonna go get some dinner and probably head back to bed. So I'm not gonna do any filming or anything because I'm feeling terrible, so I'll see everyone tomorrow for what's gonna be, hopefully, a really exciting day. Let's go. Morning, everyone. It is the next day here in Salzburg, Austria. I'm still not feeling 100%. But luckily, I am going in a car today and I am not the one driving. So let's spend the next two hours in the car on the way to this unknown destination. Let's go. Life is not real right now. Oh my god, what the hell? Look at this. The place that you've never heard of. Holstadt, Austria. Oh my god. <sighs> what? I reckon I've just found one of the best locations here. There are only, there's only four other people here, so we'll see how we go, but this looks stunning. Oh my God. It is pouring outside, so we're gonna sit in here and have some hot chocolates and coffees and stuff like that, maybe a cake, and sit in here for the next hour or so. Hopefully the rain goes. Let's see how we go. Fingers crossed. Yeah, I oh, can't really see it right there. It's finally starting to clear up, which is nice. We can actually see the mountain ranges now. 